gas of buckets breaks loose. And Swan dives 2,000 feet to the desert below. Two hundred fifty years after people. In Dubai, the world's tallest building with its 1,000 empty apartments still towers nearly half a mile above the desert floor. Sandstorms and ocean humidity have shredded the Burj Khalifa's exterior, revealing a towering skeleton quaking in the wind. In a life after people, larger wind gusts would stress the building a little bit more, cracks would open up a little bit more. Now, one question becomes critical. Which will fail first, the columns of the building's top or bottom? There's a lot of stresses in that lower area that are subjected to the, the corrosive environment next to that salt water. And as concrete cracks and becomes stressed, one potential for the collapse is its connection at the base. A huge sandstorm blows in from the desert. The tallest tower mankind ever built keels over in the largest building collapse the planet has ever seen. 